to get in front of people and share with them my views. Um, these forums aren't necessarily the best way to uh, get our ideas out there, but we have to have a certain amount of you know, rigorous format. But um, I'm going to go back a little bit uh, to when I decided to run. I decided to run as an independent because I was not getting a lot of help around the media community in Bloomington. And I saw right away that I was not going to be given the respect. There was just no chance in hell that people were going to listen to me. Uh, I'm not what they expect uh, the system to produce. Um, and the other reason was is I wanted to lay back a little bit and see what the Democratic Party was going to produce. And I'm glad I did that because I did not want to end up, and, and not a reflection of Lizard Dan, but I did not want to end up like them. What has happened is that they've slipped into the machine. And I know that it's more of a um, grassroots campaign for Dan, but it's money. We've got two capable lawyers here, and what has happened is they've, they've turned into telemarketers. If you think money is going to win or lose this campaign, you are very mistaken because the Republicans are way ahead of us. They understand the conditions to win. The Democratic Party has not figured out that yet. And if you don't understand the conditions to win, you're not going to win. And what's worse is they now control the conditions for us to win. We have to be incredibly smart, sophisticated, understand the enemy. And that's something that the Democratic Party has not done over the last few decades. They go to war looking for a victory instead of understanding what that path to victory will be or look like. If I thought money was important to this campaign for me to win, I would have been on the telephones going like, calling like crazy. Um, but I don't think that's what's important. I'll have enough money when the time comes for what I need when I need it. I, I'm more confident of that than anything else. I'm never worried about about money. So what's going to happen is that one of these two, if they get elected, they're going to go to Washington, they're going to spend their time raising more money to win their election so that they can win their next election. It's all rigged, we know it is, and I will be this bulldozer of truth. And this campaign, more than any of the others, will get you folks to put your money where your mouth is. There's no excuse for voting for the status quo, because you do have a choice now. And whether I'm successful or not, you'll know that I'm the real deal.